Aldo at 10, a promising update on a two-year-old fighting a devastating disease. You might remember Woodrow, who suffers from a rare disease similar to childhood Alzheimer's. We first brought you a story back in May when Woodrow's parents were fighting to get him accepted into an experimental drug program. ABC 15's Sonu Wasu has been following Woodrow's journey, and she joins us now with a hopeful development. Woodrow Miller, a miracle child who continues to amaze everyone with his fighting spirit and his will to live. Before he was not wanting to try to walk at all and now he's actually wanting to try to walk. I'm so excited to see what the future holds for Woodrow. A future that once seemed bleak. Just a few months ago, ABC 15 sat Every down with Denise and Ricky have. Miller, who worried their son may stand. not live to see another year. Ah. His little body getting weaker by the day because of the rare and fatal disease Neiman Pick Type C, described as childhood Alzheimer's. Every day that passed was another day that closer to having to say goodbye to him. The Millers fought hard to get baby Woodrow accepted into an experimental treatment program to access the drug Adrabetadex, a drug that has proven to be life-changing for so many other children with the same diagnosis. There's um, kids that have been taking this medication for well over a decade that are now living into their 20s. When the drug company said no, the Millers doubled down with help from the media and Arizona congressional leaders, Woodrow finally got accepted into the program. And since May, he has taken five trips to a hospital in Chicago to get five doses of Adrabetadex. Just five treatments is proof that it, this medication works. As they watch their boy grow stronger. It's, uh, it's amazing. Um, sorry. The Millers can now picture a future with their pint-sized cowboy. It is important to point out, Adrobetadex is not a life-saving drug, but it can help prolong the lives of those with Neiman Pick Type C. The Millers hope that'll buy them some time with scientists racing to find a cure for their children. Sonu Wasu, ABC 15, Arizona. I know when we first heard this story in May, we were all like, something has to be done. Yeah. Thankfully, this is the route. The right went. to try. It's yeah. Been a, a huge debate. Mm -hmm. He just looks so much better. He does you already. You see it already. Yeah. yeah.